Hi there guys, how are we doing? Phil Kent here from philkentonline.com Right, I'm um, continuing with our successful social media campaigns and the fan page training. Now, as you said, we've just done the ebook cover. We've made it all um, look really effective with a, with a, with a 3D look, etc. Um, so now what we want to do, we want to offer it up as a, uh, excuse me about that, um, we want to offer it up as a giveaway and what you also want to be doing, you want to be using the fan page as much as you can to um, build your email list as well. So instead of just having it on your, I mean, you could just sort of, you know, have it on your site somewhere and say, and take it away, sort of thing. Take this free ebook, but it's all about engaging with your audience and building your list and building a relationship with your with your fans, as it were, and your customers to your um, and visitors to your fan page. So you want to you know, op- offer some value. So many people just say, you know, they might, they might have an opt-in box on their blog, or they might even you see it sometimes an opt-in form on the fan pages, and they just say, you know, um, join my newsletter. You know, for what? You know, <laughs> you know. So he always offer something in return. You know, offer them value. Offer them give a reason to being on your email list. Okay. So what we're going to do? We're going to give away that ebook. We've made it look much more professional already. Um, I showed you how to do that, obviously. I made it how to make it much more professional already by having a, a decent looking sort of ebook just from what we created ourselves. Um, so now we're going to give it away. So. What I've done, um, as I've just gone ahead, some bits I want to go into too much. Um, I've gone over to um, my uh, autoresponder account now. I'm not going to go into creating an autoresponder, I'm not going to get too involved on that side of things, not on this video anyway. I will on other videos. Um, but basically, you you do need a autoresponder account. Um, the sort of three best ones around now are sort of AWeber, GetResponse, or GVO. Um, I'm using GVO via sort of MLSP at the moment. Um, <clears throat> and what I've basically done, I've created a new campaign. I've just written out a, a short sort of welcome email because some people will um, let them opt in and take them straight away to the the download of their choice or what they're giving away, and it's not a good idea. And um, a lot of people will give sort of dummy emails. Um, so if you if you're going to give away some sort of download, some sort of ebook, um, always let them access it from the welcome email they will receive from you. Okay, so basically they need to enter a proper email address because they're going to put a dummy email into something you've put together for them to give away. You know, if they can't be bothered to give you their correct email address, then they don't deserve to have it. That's just, just the way I look at it. Okay, now. So always, you know, put it up for access or put it up so they can get it inside their welcome email. It's it's just a much better way of working. Now I'm also with um, um, a program called MLSP. You might know that. Um, there's some information about that on my blog at philkentonline.com. Um, and what I'm going to do, what I've done, I've linked it up to this, these are some of the programs in the back, in the back office that I can, we, we can mark and give away. Um, and I'm going to give them access to this Facebook marketing gone wild okay I'm not going to have the same capture page I'm not having them entering their email address twice so I'm going to give them access um, to that um, when when they opt in okay so that's what I'm basically going to do so what I did I come over to GVO I've created a welcome email so I'll give you a quick read over just so you give you an idea you don't need to copy it word for word but you always use your own spin on it so just basically said thanks for your interest on this page you'll find access you'll find the URL to access your ebook understanding social media marketing it's a 240 page ebook covering just about everything you need to know I hope you enjoy it and find it useful get your ebook here we're going to do a hyperlink for that in a moment um, please visit my fan page regularly for more information tips and resources so you're telling the people to come back to your fan page okay it's all about engaging with your fans engaging with the the customers that you're going to be building up okay for more resources help you create successful social media campaigns and I've also put here please also take some time to visit my blog philkentonline.com where you'll find a lot more information training and useful resources so this is another reason why you put the information inside your welcome email because you know you're 
giving them what they opted in for. You're going to give them access to their free ebook, and you're also telling them you're trying to engage with your fans at an early stage by offering them value, and you're also getting them to visit your blog that you've put together. So it's sending visitors over there where they'll find more training, more resources, or you know any other information that you've put together on um, the blog yourself. Okay. Um, and then I've just added here. Thanks again. Well, thanks once again for your interest. Keep an eye on your inbox for more information and giveaways. So you're telling them, you know, to stay interested, stay engaged with your customers, and giving them a reason so not to unsubscribe and stuff like that. And then they're going to put the links in again. Get your ebook here and visit my blog here. So that gives you an idea of the sort of welcome email that you're going to be putting together. Okay. Now <clears throat> what I'm going to do, I'm going to make it easy just for the purpose of this. Um, for the purpose of, the, of this video and this training, to kind of keep it simple initially, um, before we get into more technical ways of getting access to the ebook. Okay, so now, because now you've basically given it away via your fan page, and you've captured their email address, you've got this person on your email list. You can then sort of take them slightly away. Um, <clears throat> so, if you go back to the site where we had the ebook. Okay, if you come here, this is the, the direct download for it, which is just download from here. Okay, if you right click that, and if you come over here and do copy link location, okay, copy link location, then when you go back to your message, of you know, get ebook here, you're going to highlight that, come up here to the link, okay, you're going to put your link URL in now. <coughs> Just gonna have a look at. It. I'm just gonna have a look at that link. It looks extremely long. Yeah, it looks okay. It's the ID number. Sorry about that. Um, Targeting a new window. Um, <coughs> and I'm just gonna put the title of the ebook. Understanding social media marketing. Okay. And um, we're going to insert that in there, and then once again down the bottom, get your ebook here, same again. That one there into a new window, the title, insert, okay. And then, of course, on the other one, we're going to do, I'll just grab the URL on my blog, can be blog URL. <coughs> so, you can put it inside on this one. You hyperlink it there. New window. I'll just put the name of your blog at the top there. Get it online and then insert it in there. And again down the bottom. So you're giving them more than one chance. Oops, what are we doing? More than one chance to visit your blog, and also more than one chance to get the ebook. Okay, <coughs> and then that's that. And we put um, up up top here as well. So we're going to go take the subscriber name, copy that. Welcome first name <coughs> um, here is your ebook whatever yeah um, just keep it simple and we make the writing a bit bigger than that okay and then we've got to copy this and put it into the bottom box as well for GVO. And <coughs> I've got to put the uh, links in this one as well. Okay, I'll do that after. So that's just gives you an idea of the um, the welcome message to do. So that takes you to where we're up to. Okay, just to recap now. You know, we 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 created the the ebook. How I showed you how to do that. Um, what we're going to do? We're going to give this as an option form. Um, offer it up as a as a as a freebie. Um, to capture their name and email so you can start building your email list through your fan page 
um, but don't take them straight to it um, because people will often give a fake email address we want to give them as a welcome message so if they uh, it's going to make them want to put their up proper proper name and email address in not a fake one and then on the welcome message that they received their inbox you just something along those lines with the access to the ebook okay so I'll, I'll leave the video there just want to show you that side of it um, thanks for watching and on the next video I'll show you further about how we're going to uh, create the actual um, form and option and have that on the fan page as well okay so thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next video